Are you for or against high pressure sales tactics? Most people I know, if they're on the consumer side, highly, highly avoid and dislike high pressure sales tactics. Um, I'm in real estate. My name's Lisa Stewart. I work for Berkshire Hathaway, C. Dan Joyner Realtors. I am a very active agent full time. And I just dive into all of, in my free time, all of the coaching and videos online, kind of talking about the best ways to pretty much convince people to talk to you if you're cold calling. Um, and I see it all the time. I see these high pressure sales tactics and they actually work. Um, but I came up with three things that I wanted to share with you guys just to have an, an awareness about these things that go on. Number one is beware of buyer or seller remorse. If you give in to the pressure of um, somebody telling you you need to do something and you're not ready to do it. Look, this isn't buying a um, expensive pair of tennis shoes or a new brand of shampoo. This is a huge transaction. Don't be pushed around into being told you have to sell right now. The time to sell is right now. I'd hate for you to have buyer or seller remorse. Number two, real estate agents working with a client have a contractual obligation to put the, the needs of the client above their own. So please be aware that if you feel like um, the agent is only looking out for their own needs and not listening to your needs, there may be a problem. There may be a disconnect. Number three, Figure out if the agent you're working with or considering working with is listening to what you want and what you need. How do I do my business? I run my business based off of relationships and referrals. Refer referrals are the bonus, but the biggest way that I obtain clients is through relationships and um, that only happens if I actually listen to the things that you're telling me. If I'm going on to the next question, for you and I haven't taken in the answer that you gave in, you've given me from the previous question, I'm not listening to you. That's not how I work. I am not in the business of convincing anyone to buy or sell anything that they're not interested in. There's enough people that are actually interested in buying and selling things for me not to have to go and convince somebody to do something they're not comfortable with. If this information was helpful to you at all, please like and subscribe below. Or if you found me on another means of social media, please just simply like and follow me. And of course, if you have any questions about real estate, I would love to talk to you. Hope you guys have a great day. Bye.